What are the two of you doing, huh? Help me! Help me! Help me! <laughs> oh, look. Don't, don't do that. You're gonna fall, the two of you. Give that to her. Okay, they're fighting over the cell phone. Uh, so today, we're gonna go to Vaughn's to sell cookies. Um, I think this is adding second booth sale. Uh, selling. <laughs> um, so, she's gonna, we're gonna go later on. So, uh, we're gonna do the second R for the today and like uh, last time we did it like um the f the whole two hours so we're gonna sell cookies at Vons today so I'll take uh, some videos later on there and see you there the guys and yeah this day is Saturday here and it's 11:35 so I still have enough time to change my clothes okay. Um, we have to do booth selling with for Girl Scouts to help the troop um, the remaining cookies and then whatever they sell it will be distributed to all the girls to add to their um, um, number of cookies so it's fun she enjoys it so I, I, I usually um, just do it for fun we it's once it's like maybe five minutes away from us by car but usually uh, it's just like 20 minutes walk if we go home so my husband will bring us there today drive if I can't drive for by my own without him because I'm still in learner's permit so I have to still take my driver's license uh, driving exam so that I could get my own driver's license and drive around hopefully I pass it it's a little bit scary though yeah so um, we're gonna be selling with uh, the cookies with other girls so good luck to us today and hopefully we're gonna finish some of our cookies because we have I think have remaining a hundred something Girl Scout cookie boxes there so I uh, yeah, uh, have to change because it's cold outside and the girls are already in their uh, outside clothes I'll just have to put another layer for ethel flag because it's a little bit cold and i'll just bring wagon so that because we're gonna be done at around 2 p.m and my husband will be at work we needs to be at work by 1 p 1 p.m he needs to leave the house so no one will take us home so we'll be walking later on okay so uh yeah uh why do i let Ethel, Arsinoe, sorry, uh, join, um, what do you call this, Girl Scout, because, um, yeah, um, selling cookies is just one part of being a Girl Scout, the rest, they have more activities to do, so, f um, yeah, the patches are being earned when they do something like art, horse riding, hiking, uh, something to do with signs, so, it's like, uh, usually pay, uh, to do after school activities just to uh, it's so different here because they don't have like a, have a lot of kids to play with unless you go to the park or you, you schedule a play date so with adding she's a little bit of an active kind of kid so we have to put her in more activities so girl scouts give her the chance and she's also earning a badge so it's like a win-win situation she's she's doing uh, things for herself and at the same time she's earning something that she could be proud of the second thing uh, the Girl Scout cookie sell is not um, they will not force you to really uh, do like um, an art group they let you decide how much is your goal especially for her because this is her first time they let us set our goal and I just started with 60 because um, like she's a newbie so this is also our first time and I have no relatives here or friends that I could just sell to anyone. So I have to be a little bit conservative on that. But fortunately, our neighborhood is a little bit uh, like uh, fast in buying the cookies. Like we're able to sell them immediately. So, so far we're like down to I think seven. So um, we're just going to be, I don't know if we're going to sell it because we love some of the cookies. <laughs> so. Well, we're gonna sell it if someone will be looking and then we put a signage outside and people will just be knocking on our door 
or uh, asking us if we still have cookies. So I find it a little bit easy. And one good thing with selling cookies is she earns her uh, money for the troop so that they could use for for field trips or any uh, um, somewhere they want to go. Some uh, bigger girls are already traveling to Europe with the money they earn, but it takes maybe, I don't know if it will take years to, to earn or just one cookie season. Cookie season starts around uh, January, I think, or end of February. January and then it will end around middle of March so it's not all the time you're going to be selling cookies for the whole year it's just there's a certain season and people here already knows if you say Girl Scout cookies they know it's a for a cause so part of it goes to council which is your city or city which is a Los Angeles and they're going to use it to fund some projects programs scholarships so it's a good thing you're teaching your kid to help other people and not asking for money they're doing it by themselves they have to go out and sell it and talk to people and you're you're developing their skills to be future entrepreneurs and at the same time they're also earning money for their own activities which you're gonna do so her troop decided they will go to Nuts Berry Farm I think this after the cookie season and there's like rides there and the family could have fun and I think that's their plan for this time for their money because part of it will go back to the troop and they could use it for whatever they want to do so yeah that's why I put her in a cookie uh, no sorry I put her in a Girl Scout um it's not attached to the school they do activities for the school but the school is not the one making it run but it's more in the council like ours here is los angeles and there are volunteer parents who become the leaders to um, initiate activities and us as parents we do volunteers for snacks um help them with other activities um just bring them and then the council helps with other uh we have like um places where there are stores in areas or camp site where they could do activities um so that they could earn their badge that's how the girl scout here because i was a girl scout way back in the philippines but uh, i just do i know i i skip camping because we're not able to afford that but i usually lead um um flag ceremonies in the morning and do some activities helping at school so i think it's more the school running the girl scout but i think there's also a store in jensen that also sells Girl Scout things, but there are no patches. It's just like I remembered pins, but I just borrowed it before. So that's how Girl Scout of America is here. So I, I find it refreshing. And um, as a mom, you, you, you find activities for your kids that develop them into a better um, person. And, that, and it's not so expensive because if you do to private... Um, um, groups or whatever it's a little bit expensive but this one we pay what $25 every year for their um, renewal I think of uh, membership or membership whatever they call that and that's it and the rest uh, if you do want an activity that is a little bit expensive parents could take part <laughs> What's up? I think with your diaper. That's melon. I thought it's papaya. <laughs> selling cookies we're going home we're gonna just be walking from bonds to our house because it's just like a 20 minute walk i'll tour you around redonda redonda is beautiful yes it is so um we yeah just, we just did our yes cookie cookie so this is like an automotive 
service repair. Um, center. The Vons is there. Just walk around. I forgot to take a video. And this is the Catalina cooking store. So, it was just there's a lot of stores here. Yeah, I know. And that's, um, and that's great because I love stores. Yeah, that's why I don't want to leave this place because everything is just a walking distance. But I love stores. And there's no tricycle here, so it's easy stores. to just walk around even if you're not driving. So, yeah. yeah. There's a bus stop when you want to wait for the bus. I eventually, I eventually like the, the fashion lights. And there's more stores in there. Okay, that's Daddy's favorite, the Ellen Del Hawaiian. Uh, they love the, you know, what do you call that? Um, spam. Spam. Spam must be. I'm always spamming my keyboard. So I think we're going eventually, this way. There's more stores there. But we're gonna go this way. Mom. Uh, going back to our house. Mommy. Okay, yes. I eventually like to spam my keyboard. More food, more, yes, coffee place. So, yeah. so Mommy, why is your phone number for scam? I don't know. What are you talking about, scam? Scam like the spam. A spam. It sounds like spam and scam. Okay, so we're walking. Oh, we have a scam on our phone. This girl, she's already wearing her, wearing her, um, what do you call that? An art, you know? Yoda. Yoda? Mandalorian? <laughs> um, her uniform is inside, so she's a little bit cold. That's why we have to wear something more. Buffy and... Thick. May the force be with you. <laughs> okay. Yes, this is... Like other buildings here. I rarely go to this place because a little bit expensive. Even it's a walking distance. I only go here when there's an activity or we need to buy something that we cannot go to Costco. And then, uh, yeah. So, there. Uh, we're almost done with the cookies season there it you. ends at march 12th really yes so how much cookie you sold today uh, you have no idea is yeah. it is it fun yeah okay so yeah these are just there's a big parking lot here you have to pay mommy when you park so mommy there's a credit cards or coins but I think it's more card now they use Mommy, so when I you park really, you pay I know why some someone is wear bras when they're running but why uh -huh. is, well, because it, oh, if it is for something like warm they'll be sweating so these much are cleaners they might get a bird. dry cleaning so we're gonna cross the street have to be careful make sure that okay there's a car and they have to stop Come on, Arsinoe, he's waiting. I'm so excited for the lemon ups. Okay, thank you. Okay. So there are more stores, more stores. Store stores everywhere. More food, Starbucks, and everything. And um, yeah, this is where I Okay, uh, fine, we, Mom, let's go get some Starbucks. This is where we go for... We go for our dentist appointments. This is where my doctor, I mean my dentist is, me and my husband's adding. And Ethelfled is attending a different, I mean going to a different dentist. Um, it's yeah, I, oh, this is where also my teeth, uh, wisdom teeth pulled out. <laughs> so. Mommy, where are wisdom teeth? Yeah, the teeth that behind your, behind. The last one to grow. It's really at the uh, 
like the end. Of, uh, how do you describe that? Inside your jaw? Oh, like yeah. there that won't be able to grow. Mm-hmm. So we're walking home with the girls. Oh, oh. oh where are you going? Oh my gosh! You can't walk in front of your sister. Very dramatic, si Adi. No, I. I I should go over her life. Mm, yeah, you should not be walking in behind her. I'll just... Okay. So, yeah, we're, we're walking home. I think this is it. Wait, you Cross the street. Can you... Can you pindot pindot the... Ano, Adding? Mommy, you too. Can you press the button? Yes. The button. Because it's red, we have to wait. Yeah, that's a cup. Okay, we're good to go. Mommy, what does pindot pindot mean? You push the button. Pin dot, pin dot. So yes, there's copper pot. It's an Indian grill coffee. I've always wanted. I'm to curious. I've I'm always wanted to try their food. Yeah, uh, yeah. It smells so good when you pass by here. Yeah, I know. It's like I don't so want to try. I smell the spices sometimes. It when, when walk I'm by. only with the two girls because it's gonna be difficult to eat out with two girls. So. Maybe someday they have really nice plants here. Um, I can smell the spices. There, adding was saying. Smell adding? I can smell the spices. So of the great, curry. yeah. I can it smell reminds spices. me of the Philippine Indian restaurants there. The name Bella. Yes, yeah, so we're walking home. We did play for a while with that uh, doggy there. So cute. Yes, yeah, she is so cute. She is 11 years old. She is very friendly. She is very nice. So we're walking home. And she loves kids. Mm -hmm. In fact, I know. Yes. She's very, very cute. Yeah. Uh, most of the people here are dog. They have dogs and cats, and they treat them as kids. And once their kids grow up, uh, they will have pets. To grow with them because usually kids at 18 they go out they move out they go to college they have and then they will start working have their own place or apartment and parents are left alone so i have to be ready for that with these two girls that i have someday they'll I be might out be able to visit the doggy. yeah so yes I yeah, she's doggy. a little bit sad, that woman there, because her kids are all out of the house and it's only the dog. And she says she misses her kids and it's so sad. This is the only thing here um, because Mom, might be able they're very independent. You. Usually the, the parents are left alone in the house and the parents should find things to make them busy and start their and lives all over again when the kids are out. Yeah, kind of like re, 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 So our mommy has to find things like to be re, busy someday. Kind of like being re, 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 giving birth to another child and doing it all over and over again. Yeah, but the dogs are different. Yeah, they don't but dogs keep on are calling me mommy, mommy, mommy. Yeah, <laughs> but they just bark. They just bark or talk. You want to bark? Like Take a dog? <laughs> April is me. coming. So Easter and Passover flowers are available. This is how... They, they celebrate Easter with an, I think an I, lily of the valley flowers. So this is like one of the uh, flower shop here that has my name. Yes, it is. So yeah, you just go there and order flowers, which is they have very pretty flowers inside. Beautiful so. flowers. Are, there are beautiful flowers inside. And I guess that's why there's. They so have beautiful here. flowers outside. Do you see that? So pretty they are. Yeah, they're like. Yeah, this baby is small. Yeah, this looks cute. Ethelfled wants to walk. She doesn't want to ride on her stroller. Um, yeah, they're walking. The, the two alien. The very pink and the very green alien. And this is the farmer's um, bank. It's one of the big banks here big banks but I go where you call this so yeah there's more stores here more food shops more hair saloon um yeah we have this shabu shabu there again which I wanted to go but I don't want to go alone with the kids
here so that place at the bottom part used to be um what's that uh, no adding that closed before what's that our favorite uh, burger fries uh arsinawi if you want to do tattoo we have it here <laughs> okay go what's the place before that uh, closes that part of oh? let's oh, go arsinawi why are you stopping oh, here yeah. Oh my goodness! What's place? What place is that before? Oh, can you still remember? That is the Arby's. Arby's, yes, and they close. I think it's a bakery, so they yeah, have fail or signage. I really love Arby's. Yeah, unfortunately, they close now. No. So we can just walk. All the way to our home, to our house, but then from where the Vons is. So we, since there is, um... hi! Oh my goodness, they're so cute. <laughs> they are. <laughs> yes, they are. Okay, so we're gonna cross the street again. Yeah, it's very hilly here. And there's the beach on the other side. Yes, and this is why. Yes, they are. And then there's burritos tacos place here. So, of course, yoga fitness, packaging store. We pass by um jewelry store. What else is there? Hair salon again, music lessons. Yeah, there and of course churches. We have churches here. Yeah. So you want to do music lessons? They have it here. Um, I want to play the guitar. No. Look at these two yeah, girls. This is what we're doing when we're walking. Oh my goodness. Okay. And then, yeah. So there's local kitchens, micro food hall. That's what they call. Is this a coffee shop? So there's a lot of food in here. That's why I'm getting fat. Finally, she sits and she's gonna eat and we're gonna walk and adding keeps on yapping about a certain song and yeah don't her face she just scratched that with her long nails which I forgot to cut early and I continue walking because mommy cannot drive without daddy <laughs> mommy has to get her driver's license first yeah so. we should probably start moving on to the business Okay, we're going on. Still walking Mommy, beside the street. It's I not think, busy. I think uh, you're so. You, I think you should start driving on a busy street now. Oh, I'm driving on a busy street. Where Where do I drive? Um, on PCH. I'm driving on PCH. Okay. When Dad is here. Yeah, I should probably. Because I should not be driving without him. Because once the police will see me, I will. They will put me. Yeah, in, living uh, this is where people who wants to live like by themselves but they're scared of being left alone in their house um, you could go there here and someone will take care of you it's a little bit pricey but yeah most of the people who doesn't have families to take care they go here and then of course it's their, it's their urgent care it's like a, a hospital but these are for like light uh, cases like UTI, small um, symptoms of colds or flu, you can go there. They call it urgent care uh, because their emergency room here is for really like people who needs help. So, okay, no, yeah, no. they call it Kensin Kensington Assisted Living and Memory Care Community. So they have it here. It's just near our house. No, don't step on the. So, usually we go here 
for Wanna Chill, adding a favorite place for shave ice. And our subway that we love to go to. And they have dominoes there and some other things. So there's a lot of things going on here. Okay, yung dalawa. Ito yung urgent care dito. Uh, this is where I bought, I brought adding when she had, like I thought appendicitis, but it turns out to be COVID. So they do like urgent care thing there. And I had the UTI when I first arrived. So this is just a walking distance from our house. Yeah, even my husband is not there. I could go there. And sometimes if you need an yung emergency they can call the ambulance for you but yeah i think they can do quick um relief and like sa hospitals they're gonna um really do the more complicated and more worst cases when you're sick so there we're like maybe um 10 minutes away from the house we're still walking and walking and walking there. They're fixing things. There's Dominus there, Subway. And there are other shops here that closest when it was COVID time. So, yeah, there are places where you could sleep when you're visiting Redondo. 